Tom Burkhart here along with Madeline Avidog from Heavenly Ski Patrol. I know it's Safety Awareness Week. Correct. Yeah. And we got a couple days left, right? We have two more days left today and tomorrow. Um, we'll culminate our weeks long effort to uh, you know, educate the public on you know, skiing safely. Uh -huh. As sa skiing is your, safety is your responsibility. I always say safety is no accident. That's, you're absolutely right. That's what it is. You have to work at it. It just doesn't come. Cool. Without so, help. I mean, I know, I know Matt, uh, Madeline's an avalanche dog. Uh, in, in theory, could dig up someone buried in avalanche. Do you have to actually be skiing with a tennis ball in your pocket, or will she do it regardless? No, she does it regardless because she thinks that there's a, a, a reward <laughs> afterwards. Exactly. It's just a repetitive training, and we'll usually carry that, or we'll give it to someone else so that she can... Oh. Schutzen! Schutzen! I'd have just seen him do that on the SWAT movie yeah, exactly. one time. I don't know. To uh, you know, a reward. It's all about the reward. Play the game and then reward her with whatever it takes. Right, if it's, right. You know, the Swiss teaches to use sausage when we're first trading them. Damn, I would dig up somebody for sausage or well, bacon. We, we tell everybody, you know, the cheap man's beacon is a you know, nut bone on <laughs> exactly. a string around your neck. So exactly they'll, right. they'll find that as well. Ski with bacon if you're heading out. Uh, but, but is that what you look for when you're, when you're you know, kind of trying to pick, pick the dog that you're going to look as one that has that, what really likes the game, the, the game of playing, retrieving, and that sort of thing? When you pick your dog, it's all about a dog that's motivated and that keys into you as well. Mm -hmm. Someone that, you know, attracted you and a dog that's, you know, stands out of, above the rest of the dogs. Mm -hmm. You don't want the sleepy-eyed guy. You want the guy who's alert, who's up there, and who wants to, you know, please. Right. And that's usually what you found. We found Madeline down in a litter down in Jackson, California, and uh, she was a, a go-getter from the beginning. Yeah, yeah, that's great. Well, it's good to have these dogs on, on call, you know, on the mountain and... Everybody, right? Everybody just loves seeing, oh, seeing they, the dogs. They, they love the dogs. They love to go dogs. out there and you know pet them, and they need their dog fix. A lot of people come. <laughs> yeah, right, right. Dogs. Go on vacation go on away vacation. from your dog. So totally. they want to come and oh, please. Um, uh, one of the ways that you're helping to raise awareness for Safety Awareness Week is through uh, a poker run you guys are putting on. Yes, this year we have a poker run. Uh, we have these cards at all the stations, and at the first aid bases where you go around to the stations, you pick a card, we write it down. After you recite one of the uh, safety codes, do you know one of the safety codes there, Todd? Always uh, wait 30 minutes after eating before skiing powder. Uh, well, I think that's a rollover from the swimming. Oh, God, good. I'm joking you. Uh, <laughs> never ski with scissors. That's uh, definitely a safe one. But uh, <laughs> Tell me one. Uh, this week's, today's the sixth day, so the sixth code, actually it's the seventh day, is to... Uh, know how to safely load the lifts mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. and uh, that's you know a key one that machinery that you're around you have to pay attention when you're in the line you scoot out there too soon that machinery runs into you uh, you're going to get hurt you mm. got to pay attention because that is heavy equipment you got to load and unload properly absolutely yeah. you got to pay attention to where the, the board is you got to stand up and ski away from the lift because uh, nothing worse than getting Tagged yeah. by one of those. Well, and also, too, I mean, even after you've unloaded safely, to clear the area. Because you hear it, you go to different resorts, and some are better than others, where they're saying, hey, get out of the way. You know, it's just constant. People are unloading there. Unload, get off and away from everybody. I mean, it, that seems to make sense. Um, for the poker run, how do people get involved in this, and, and what does it take? Um, like, say, you go to each one of the patrol stations or down to the base facilities and ask for one of these cards. And then you ski around to all the facilities, and we have a deck of cards, and that's where you draw from. And we write it down, and at the end of the week, all these cards go into a raffle for a pair of skis and a snowboard, which will be drawn tomorrow late or Sunday morning. Uh -huh. uh, you, can, you can enter as many times as you want. Uh, it's been kind of slow so far, so there's still two days to go out there and get a chance to win a nice snowboard and some skis. Yeah. Plus, we'd like you to come into our stations, visit, see what we're all about. If you want to ski around with the patrollers, we're happy to do that. Um, today, we've got uh, rope rescue, like I say, at the mid station, open house at the stations as well. And you're always invited anytime to come by, see what we're all about, and ask us questions. Uh, meet the dogs. We have trading cards that we give out for the dogs. Here's one for you, Todd, oh. as well. For uh, It's a good thing to go out and try to collect. It's a fun thing to come up and see the dogs and let them smell you. Um, there's nothing worse than being out there stranded and not knowing what to do. And our dogs do a great job of coming out there to help, and they just do it like a game. Yeah. 
Well, all right, good to have you, Tom Burkhart from Heavenly Ski Patrol along with Madeline. Um, and then today's the last day of safety week. Tomorrow is actually the last day. We'll be at the top of the tra uh, excuse me, Tamarack Lodge tomorrow doing snow safety demos. And we'll have the dogs there doing some uh, burials, some article burials as well. And you'll be able to take photographs. I think all of our dogs should be there tomorrow. I think but one of them has the day off. Yeah, it's got to give the dogs a break. And one of the great prizes that we want to give you is a nice, wonderful pair of these heavenly sunglasses. Oh, look at these. Huh? From the poker run. Those are uh, some classic collectors, some... Uh, Patrol style. Exactly, They're exactly. They're red. You can tape on a little white cross on there and... Uh, be part of the team. Yeah, keep up the good work. You guys do good work up there. And Madeline, same thing. Uh, join them up there on the patrol with the poker run. Support it. And we're going to take a quick break and be back with your seven-day forecast.